All right, this here is a 1955 Olympia SM3 in Burgundy. And let's walk around and take a look. Um, those of you who are Olympia collectors, I know you know all the little differences between the different SM models. Um, but let's walk through and I'll show you what you can find on the SM3. So the SM3, let's start with the back. And you're going to find manual tab sets on the back of the SM3. And so you just press and drag and you just put the tabs wherever you want them to go. Okay, so that's how that works. Let's put this back down. All right, right here on the right side, there's this little button. If you press that, there's your paper holder and you can lift it up if you want. I'll keep that up for the video. Here's your margins. Instead of pressing down and dragging, you squeeze and drag your margins to where you would like them to be. Okay, so your carriage release is the flat lever right here. Okay, so that's how that works. And then let's go ahead and leave that to the left side before I open the top. Here is where you set if you want to advance single, double, or triple lines, okay? Let's open the top. And I like to keep the carriage over to the left when opening the top so that the handle doesn't scrape the top of the, um, of the typewriter. So it does take a universal ribbon. Now the Olympias have a little arm, spring-loaded arm right here and right here. So when you try to pull it out and you're like, it's not pulling out, you just got to move the spring-loaded arm. So you thread it through what looks like a little double barrel and then these guide wires back here, black on top, red on bottom. The SM3 has a deluxe um, uh, stamped into the escapement there. To change the direction of the ribbon, you just move, you just press your, these little double barrel looking things right here, okay? So for those of you new to typewriters, there's plenty of ink in the ribbon, but when it gets to the end, you need to reverse the direction um, back and forth at, until you use up all the ink. This determines how hard your type um, keys strike your paper, so that is just a personal preference how you want to adjust that. Let me go ahead and close this. Here's your, you saw in the back where you set your tabs. This is how you adjust there. Margin release, this is for when you get to the end. When you're at your margin and you can't go any further, margin release, and now you can go further if you want, and then return. Now this right here, if you press it up, this is gonna lock your keys so you can't press anything, and then you unlock it that way. Your color selector is down here, it's on black, you can put it down on red. Okay, let's go ahead and load a piece of paper and do some typing. Oh, I loaded that really well. In case you do get it crooked, then you can pull that forward. That releases the tension on the paper and you can adjust it. But hey, I got that pretty good. Okay, let's go ahead and type on this and see how she does. So there's no number one, you use the lowercase l for the number one. If you've ever typed on Olympia, you just know how different it feels compared to other typewriters. They're just, there's nothing like them. They're amazing. And if that ever happens, you just tap it down.
Okay, let's switch to the red ribbon and try that out. So here you go. You can look at the link in our description to see how uh, it typed on the font on it. Olympias are great typewriters. If you are looking for something to work on a book, manuscript, a longer project, Olympias are going to be great for you. I'll be really honest on this one. It is not the best Olympia we've had, but it's going to be an excellent Olympia. It's still going to be very sufficient for your longer writing projects. So our price will reflect that it's not in as pristine a condition as some of our um, other Olympias that we have sold, but it you are not going to be disappointed. There's really nothing wrong with it. I'm just making this comment so that you know some of the other Olympias type a little bit smoother and um, do not show, this one shows a little bit more wear than some of the other ones that we have had, but you are still going to be very happy with this and it's still going to work really, really well for you and you're going to love it. Thanks so much for watching. If you have any questions, let us know. Please visit the uh, link in the description below to see the details on this and have a great day.